there, and welcome to day 23 of 40 Days to Mercy. I'm Peter Gordon, and I'm a parishioner at Mary Queen of the Apostles Parish in Salem, Massachusetts. I'll be your host in these daily exercises as we examine our conscience to prepare for Easter. Don't forget to download our guide. See a link in the description below. While you're at it, subscribe to our channel and share the videos with some people that you know. Today's topics are freedom and prudence. These two topics are closely related. Early in Jesus' ministry, he had the opportunity to read at the synagogue, and he read from the book of Isaiah. The book of Isaiah described the Messiah's mission as proclaiming liberty to captives. St. Paul also used this image of being captive or a slave to sin. There are actual sins that we have committed, and then there's also patterns of brokenness or injury or addiction that lead us into sin. Freedom is that ability to act one way or another or not at all. We often think of freedom as the ability to do whatever we want, whatever we choose. To the extent that what we do is based on tendencies, addictions, attachments, or desire for worldly things, are we really free? Or are we slaves to those things? If we are freed from sin, an attachment to sin, our brokenness and worldly things, all of which limit our freedom, what are we now freed to do? Now, St. Paul said, we're free to love one another. One of the virtues that is important to have along with freedom is prudence. This virtue helps us make decisions between good and evil, truth and lies, reason and folly. With prudence, we know when to seek counsel, give counsel, do some research or planning, exercise some caution, act or not act, continue or stop. Prudence helps guide our freedom towards loving one another. With that background, let's begin our examination of day 23 with a prayer, and then ask ourselves some questions. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Come, Holy Spirit. Heavenly Father, help us understand you as a God who loves us. Help us to see ourselves as you see us, and to love ourselves as you love us. Here are our questions for today. Do we allow ourselves to be slaves to our desires or senses or worldly things? Do we help or hinder others in their freedom or even seek to restrict it? Do we seek out truth, use reason, seek counsel, and use good means to achieve our ends? Do we accept advice, make decisions, persevere, and exercise caution? Heavenly Father, thank you for the freedom you have granted us through Jesus and help us to be prudent in exercising our freedom so that we may love one another as you call us to. We ask all this in Jesus' name, amen. In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, amen. Well, that's it for day 23. God bless you and see you tomorrow.